Hello. Today we're going to drink uh, Ashi Premium X Coffee, and uh, it says it uses 1.4 times the amount of beans as in a normal coffee, and it has a bunch of other coffee-related jargon that you see on all the other cans. It smells kind of good. Hmm. It's kind of average. Um, you can definitely tell it uh, has um, like a deeper flavor. Uh, it's not so bad. Yeah, it's actually kind of creamy. Um, it's not really thick looking. Um, but this is maybe one of the better coffees from this company. So this is the Acid Premium X Coffee. And stay tuned. We're going to drink some more coffee for you. Thanks. Welcome back. Now we're going to drink a Georgia Emblem Black Coffee. And uh, from before, um, the Emblem series from Georgia has been pretty good. Uh, we had that one that was just creamy and there was no sugar. Um, had a pretty nice taste. This is the Zaytaku Drip. Hey, thanks for sticking around. Next up, we've got the Wanda Extra Rock, and uh, they have this On the Rock series, uh, which maybe is related to cocaine in some way. Um, but they have that nice uh, crushed can look on the can design here, and it supposedly has a double espresso flavor, um, or like a scent or something. And it's a black coffee with sugar. Um, we're thinking maybe it's something like the Boss iced coffee from before. Let's see how this one tastes. Black coffee looks kind of thick, actually. It's really sweet, but I'm not sure if I like it. Hmm. The flavor is kind of along the lines of that uh, Boss Ice Coffee from before. Like it kind of catches you off guard. It's really sweet, but it's a black coffee. This one, however, um, I don't know. It's not so good. Uh, I preferred the other one, and I think I prefer the other On the Rock coffees from Wanda. Let's give this another go. Yeah, I'm going to have to give this one a pass. Um, this is the Wanda Extra Rock Double Espresso Blend. And uh, stick around, we've got another coffee for you. See you in a bit. Welcome back. For our last coffee today, we've got the Roots Jamaican Coffee. And uh, it's got the Roots Explorer uh, logo on the top. And it has that can with a little rib at the top, just like the, uh, like the hard shot. Um, and the tea marriage from before. Uh, they also have a nice, uh, like an iced coffee that was pretty delicious. Um, this one has coconut milk in it, and uh, it's supposed to create an island or resort mood. So I can really go for that today. So we're gonna give it a shot. Oh, that's very creamy looking. Kind of a unique and delicious scent. Whoa, that's really good. It has a really distinct flavor. Uh, it's really sweet, kind of along the lines of a Max Coffee or the Queen's Latte from before. Um, 
can taste that coconut milk. And I could see enjoying this on a nice summer day like today. Uh, unfortunately, it's kind of getting dark outside, so I can't really enjoy the sun anymore. But this is some delicious coffee, and I'm going to get it another can next time I see it. So, if you see it, you should buy a can for me. This is the Roots Jamaican Coffee. And uh, that's all we have for you today. So we'll see you next time for more coffee from Japan. Thanks. Oi man, we gonna drink a Jamaican coffee now. Why can't I do it? I, I can't do it.